That's right. <laughs> New UFO proof hat, specially made for me. But uh, if you guys want a UFO proof hat, um, I can have a more made up and ready to order for everyone. I don't know if it'll be this particular design. If you want it, you can have it. But I don't think it's like the perfect fit for everybody, but um, um, I do have some cool designs. So uh, hopefully you guys uh, will pick some up and if you like it or whatever. So um, just got it. Rocking the UFO proof hat. Fucking love it. And this is coming from an inverse science article, right? Six years ago, some worker was stripping away sandstone and stuff at, at the Canadian oil sands. And he like hit some rock thing and uh, he looked at it and it wasn't like anything he'd ever seen before. And so they dug it out <laughs> and it's like the most complete fossilized dinosaur ever. I'm talking like everything on this thing is like perfectly preserved. So you get to see like what the actual dinosaur looks like. Not like its bones, but like its skin and everything. Like the whole dinosaur is perfectly like frozen in time, dude. This thing is fucking amazing. I guess um, it's like one of these armored dinosaurs, the, the Notosaur or whatever. It's um, uh, they said it was a it's a billion to one odds of finding a complete dinosaur like this, this well preserved. I mean, it's fucking cool. Apparently this happened like six years ago and they have been slowly chipping away everything to reveal it now. So it's taken this long to get everything cleaned up and so it looks good, but it is like the most complete dinosaur you've ever seen in your life. And I mean, this thing crazy looking. So um, we're, we're, I'm gonna show you a picture of it, you know, but not to the end. <laughs> um, but this, uh, this dinosaur lived 110 million years ago and they believe that it died by being hit by a flood and then washing into the ocean and then its gases cause it to turn belly up and then uh, it finally popped um and then stank like a rock and when it hit the bottom it like impacted like a crater it hit so fucking hard that all the soot and everything fell over top of it and then a bunch of different gases were released and everything and caused the the sands and stuff to create concretion you know um it's like just you know sticking sands and rocks together We're, we like we make concrete N nature makes its own form of concrete as well and they made some kind of concrete cocoon and preserved this fucking dinosaur like perfectly kind of like um uh pompeii and how like they had the like the plaster cast molds of all the people who died there or whatever it's kind of like that in a sense um but i mean it's uh it's really it's fucking amazing man look at this fucking thing dude i mean this look okay now look look at that that's a fucking that's a fucking dinosaur dude i'm sorry but fuck that's cool dude. look at those spikes on that thing dude how'd you like to get one of those up your fucking ass man that thing is cool looking dude. you can see his head you can see his eyes i mean everything i look at the big ass spikes it kind of looks like a fucking crocodile doesn't it like these big spikes on its back kind of i mean but these are really big <laughs> compared to a crocodile you know so i mean you know that's uh that's really cool the, these pictures of like the material like you could see the tendons in the the, the 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 tan material is bone and the brown stripes are tendons inside of this fucking dinosaur that's how well the shit was preserved and the inside of it is like clay like it's organs and all that stuff it's still there but it became like this this fine dust and shit that will just like disappear so they have to be really really careful with it but um they said it's like has the consistency of like talcum powder <laughs> all right that's how fucking like weak this shit is on the inside of it but the outside is fucking super hard man so i mean how, how cool is that man uh i don't know they even have like the remains of what was the dinosaur was eating like the plants and the seeds and stuff that were in its stomach when it died, it, it was still there. That's fucking awesome, dude. That gives me hope that there might be some other cool finds like that, you know? So, who knows, man? Um, I just wanted to do a story on this real quick because I thought it was super, super fascinating. And um, I also want to give a big shout out to Rorare Bush, my man, UFO bro, for uh, supporting me on Patreon. You fucking rock, dude. <laughs> Just for you, man, all right? Fucking hell yeah. Thank you guys so much. So that's super cool, and I just wanted to get this video out. I know it's a quick, short video, but I thought you guys would really want to hear about that because it's fucking awesome, all right? All right, you guys. UFO Proof, out.